What is going on everybody? Welcome back to my studio. My name is Louie Lively and I'm so happy you are here. Today we're going to talk about my two all-time favorite amplifiers I have ever had the pleasure of playing through. We're talking Bob Bradshaw, John Sir, Custom Audio, the best of the best in my personal opinion and I've been lucky enough to, to be playing a Custom Audio PT100 and OD100 and stuff for, for years now and I just recently acquired the the new Sur PT100, the most recent iteration and um, it's a completely different animal but it's the same in, in many ways and it's just as good just in a different way 
and they are they are my my truly my all time favorite rigs that I've that I've been able to to, to own and play through and and uh, I want to show you the differences between the two and how they sound and uh, I think you're going to be surprised but in a good way so they're basically the same thing uh, but I I would say that the Sur the new one is a bit more refined, you know? The, the custom audio is kind of like balls out, just straight up rock and roll. You know, it's just modern sounding, but you can make it sound vintageier. That's a word today. Um, and the Sur is just a little more refined, like you grew up, it went to college or something, you know what I mean? Uh, it's not the, the custom audio is like the party boy, you know what I mean? And the Sur kind of grew up a little bit and it's a little more refined it's 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 worldly you know what i mean it it's a little more compressed it's it's uh it's a little more uh it, it sounds it sounds more like a vintage plexi which is what they were going for primarily and my favorite thing is is the 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 boost it's a mosfet boost built into the amplifier i'm telling you i don't care if i had a board i i you give me a delay pedal and that amp and I can play any gig there is. Any gig, any gig you throw at me, I can play with that amp. It's so versatile, it's fantastic. I'm partial to my custom audio just because it's been with me since, you know, I started a music career, a professional music career, and it's been everywhere with me, and it's, it just holds a place, you know, and uh, it will never be replaced, but the Sur does a fantastic job, and it's so versatile, it's fantastic. So I'm gonna go over there. I'm gonna show you some different tones. You know, it's got a very Fender clean tone and a very Marshall Plexi dirty rhythm channel, which you can clean up and get country and, and all kinds of stuff. And then the lead channel is just straight up modded Marshall goodness, the best modded Marshall I've ever played through. A couple different guitars will do, you know, some Strat style and of course Les Paul style or Les Pauls, I should say. Um, and you know we'll go through the whole tonal range if you haven't yet subscribed i would love if you would and i will keep you up to date on all my guitar geekiness so enough chitter chatter let's get down to it so the amps are all going to go through my sir reactive load set to a 4x12 with greenbacks and an sm57 and a 121 just for consistency and i don't feel like miking up a cabinet you might notice, I don't know if I'll be able to get a take without it, the, the clean channel on the custom audio is going to have a little crackle because there's something wrong with it and I haven't gotten it sent to them to have it fixed yet. Alright, so we're going to go through the custom audio first. I'm using my Tom Anderson uh, Hollow Drop Top Classic uh, and I'm going to use their, their switching system here allows you to put the bridge pickup in with the middle and neck. So we're going to start with that on the clean channel of the custom audio PT100.
So now there's a little boost uh, function uh, on the clean channel here. And uh, we're going to engage that and turn the volume down a little bit because it, it, gets, it gets pretty loud. <laughs> So on the clean channel, you can get a pretty, uh, a pretty gritty. breakup but you know almost you know classic rock kind of sound so now I've switched over to the sir we're gonna get some stratty tones uh, the volume on, on the custom audio or on the OD channel now it's like three and it's just gritty <laughs> Perfect for those real stratty kind of. You know, it sounds like a you know, it's strat. Now's when things start to get fun, for me at least. Got my Les Paul. We're gonna crank the gain up. I usually run it around seven.
One of my favorite things about this Sur PT100 that the Custom Audio doesn't have is this built-in MOSFET boost. And it's like having a, a dirt pedal, you know, on your board. This is without... Without... And this is on the rhythm channel, this isn't on the lead channel. So this is without it. With. It's like having a lead boost, a, a dirt pedal. You know, something that, that takes your, your, your rhythm crunch and gives you a little bit extra. And then the lead channel is just even more. It's a great feature and makes this thing super versatile. And last but not least, we've got the, the lead gain three channel, which has a separate gain and volume control, which is one of my favorite features about this amp. Click the lead on and... I think I'm gonna grab a different guitar. Now the lead channel with the boost. This is without. This is with. All right, so tell me what you think. Which one do you like better? Do you like the custom audio? Do you like the Sur? You know, uh, what do you like better about either one? What don't you like? Tell me in the comments below. I would love to know your thoughts and some feedback. And uh, let me know what else you would like to see. Some other amp head-to-heads, pedal, pedal head-to-heads. Tell me, tell me what you'd like to see. I'd love to know. Like I said earlier, I'm partial to the custom audio just because it, it holds a special place inside me and you can't replace that. You know, it's, it's like my Les Paul, it's, you know, I'll be buried with it, you know what I mean? So to me, it's very special and it just has a sound and that was the sound that was in here and I'm so thankful that, that I can get it out with that amp and, and I don't have to play that tone search for years and years. Yeah, I mess with other things. That's just because I'm, I'm, I'm a guitar geek. We all do it, you know what I mean? That's why you're watching this. But that is my holy grail desert island. The Sur does a fantastic job. That would have to be my second favorite amp right behind the Custom Audio PT100. 
and let's negate the fact that Pete Thorne has an incredible ear for tone, you know, outside of Bob Bradshaw and, and John Sir. At the end of the day, I would always pick the custom audio, but they are, I can't wait until all this COVID shit is over and I can get that Sir out on the road and see what it can really do. I'm, I'm truly looking forward to that. Thanks again for watching. I appreciate you stopping by. If you liked what you saw, please like, subscribe, share, comment, you know, hit me up on Instagram and Twitter, and I'll see you in the next video.